Hi everyone, Michael Dowling here from McGrath at Ride. Welcome to this week's Ride Market Updates. Now we're just coming to you from our, the rooftop level of our new office at 734 Victoria Road in Ride. We're directly next door to the Ride X Services Club um, near the entrance for Lane Cove Road. So if you are looking for any real estate needs, make sure you feel free to pop into our office, have a chat, check out the new modern arrangement that we've got here. It's a fantastic open plan office. Uh, the team is really enjoying the new space. Uh, not to mention this rooftop level. As you can see behind me, we've got amazing views. Uh, we've got the Harbour Bridge views um, to the right of me as well. So it's, it's just a great, great location. It's gonna be a great opportunity for us to have some in-house auctions on the rooftop over the coming months. Obviously now that weather's starting to fine up through spring and summer. Um, so if you are looking for your home to be auctioned off, this is gonna be a great spot for us to do some incredible in-house auctions over the next few months. Uh, obviously the real estate market, spring is well upon us. It's definitely crept up and obviously we're five days into September. The team and I are very happy to announce that in the first five days of spring, we've sold five properties. So uh, we're on track, one from one at the moment, five out of five. So it's an amazing achievement from the team. Um, obviously some properties to take note of, seven Battered Jaws Road in Ride, the heritage listed home, uh, the original 1885, um, cottage that is in Battered Jaws Road. We've sold that. It is in a cooling off period at the moment. Uh, there's been obviously a bit of interest around the property, a bit of uncertainty. Uh, there is general uncertainty in the market as well, but being a heritage listed property, it took a bit of education for some buyers to understand uh, what that meant. And, and obviously the, the cans and can'ts in regards to the property, um, but very happy to say that young family have bought that property and are gonna be loving that location as far as the 900 metre square block and the, the heritage cottage that's on. It's an amazing renovated four bedroom home uh, and they're particularly excited that they've secured that one. Now, interestingly enough, the property passed in at auction at 1.6 two weeks ago. Uh, we had a significant amount of buyers trying to offer 1 1.5, 1 1.55 um, and even under that. However, the property has been sold between 1.65 and 1.7. So uh, obviously as far as a result, it's, it's sold significantly higher than where it passed in at. Um, it just goes to show there is still confidence out there in the market and properties are still selling. As I'm saying to a lot of people at the moment, relative patience is required because there's quite a, a different dynamic of buyers out there at the moment. Some buyers have gone extremely opportunistic in the current environment. Other buyers are being very realistic and do want to secure the home before Christmas to be able to move in and enjoy that Christmas uh, roast with the family. Obviously, we are only three months out from that now. So if you are serious about buying, make sure you come forward. We did also sell 1B Andrew Street in West Drive during the week, which is an amazing result. Uh, now that property has been on the market for a bit of time and this is the third property that we've had a signed contract, third time we've had a signed contract on that property um, due to finance for the first two times. Unfortunately, it didn't eventuate um, and this buyer is now extremely ecstatic to secure the property in West Drive. So uh, congratulations to all of those buyers and, and sellers. Uh, over the coming weeks, we're gonna have some great opportunities to showcase some other properties. One really to take note of is 11 Hinkler Avenue in Ride. Today at the first open home, we had 30 groups through the property. Um, now I really wanna say a thank you to a lot of those buyers that came through, the patience that you showed. Obviously with social distancing, we are having to sort of space groups out coming through the property. Um, so it was great to see so many buyers being very patient and understanding in regards to the current environment. But 30 groups through that property on the first open day, uh, that goes to auction in three weeks time. And I'm sure we're gonna be bringing you that result, whether it be on auction day or beforehand. Another one to take note of is number three, James Street in West Ride, uh, Melrose Park, sorry. That one is getting significant amount of interest at the moment. Auction for that one is in two weeks time. Uh, today at the open home, we had four second inspections. So a fair bit of interest around that property at the moment. Obviously with the spring market well upon us now, there's gonna be more properties coming onto the market and maybe a little bit of an increase in supply. Interestingly enough, over the last two weeks, we would have thought by now, year on year, that we would have a lot more properties on the market than what there currently is. Although supply has increased, it hasn't increased uh, according to the standard of last year and the year before. So it'd be interesting to see what does happen over the next few weeks. Uh, as far as obviously a lot of buyers out there expecting that the market is going to drop as far as price levels, there's definitely gonna be some opportunities out there. There's no doubt about that, but they're gonna be few and far between as far as we're thinking at the moment. Uh, obviously most properties are selling, even if the property does require a little bit of patience uh, as far as the sales side of things. 
It might take a, a couple of days extra after auction or even a week or two, um, but the right buyer is eventually coming along and securing the property at a relative level to, to where the owner is either wanting or nearby where we expected at the start of the campaign. So um, that's the real market at the moment. Obviously over the next few weeks, there is gonna be some great auctions. 24 Pindari Street in North Ryde goes to auction next Saturday, uh, as well as 12 Ryrie Street in North Ryde. So we'll be sure to bring you those results over the next week. If you have any real estate needs, make sure you give me a call. Uh, obviously my number's in the, in the um, Facebook page. Feel free to give me a call, more than happy to help with any of your property goals, whether you're looking to buy, sell, or possibly just a bit of advice to navigate over the spring period and summer months. Thanks very much, speak to you soon.